Ravel by Jean Ekinaz is a novel that chronicles the life and career of Maurice Ravel, a famous French composer known for his unique style of music. The novel is a fictionalized account of Ravel's life, but it is based on historical facts and events. The story begins with Ravel's early years and takes us through his education, his rise to fame, and his eventual decline. One of the most striking things about Ravel is its narrative style. Ekinaz employs a minimalist style of writing that is both efficient and elegant. His sentences are short and to the point, yet they contain vivid and precise descriptions that bring the story to life. The result is a fast-paced, immersive narrative that keeps the reader engaged from beginning to end. The novel is divided into four parts, each of which covers a different period in Ravel's life. The first part focuses on Ravel's childhood and early education, as well as his relationship with his parents. We learn about his love of music and his prodigious talent for playing the piano. We also see his struggles with his health and his difficulty fitting in with his peers. In the second part of the novel, we see Ravel's rise to fame as a composer. He begins to attract attention with his innovative compositions and becomes one of the most sought-after composers of his time. Ekinaz does an excellent job of describing Ravel's creative process and the challenges he faced in bringing his vision to life. The third part of the novel focuses on Ravel's decline. We see him struggling with his health, both physical and mental, and we witness his struggles with alcohol and drugs. Ekinaz's descriptions of Ravel's mental state are particularly poignant, as we see him descending into a world of delusions and hallucinations. The final part of the novel deals with Ravel's death and its aftermath. We see how his legacy lives on after his passing and how his music continues to inspire generations of musicians. Throughout the novel, Ekinaz does an excellent job of capturing the essence of Ravel's music. He uses language to evoke the moods and emotions that Ravel's music is famous for and he gives us a sense of what it must have been like to hear Ravel's music for the first time. At the same time, he also captures the personal struggles and challenges that Ravel faced throughout his life. One of the most notable themes of the novel is the idea of artistic obsession. We see how Ravel was completely consumed by his music, to the point where it took over his life and his health. At the same time, we also see how his music was the one thing that gave him purpose and meaning in life. The novel explores the tension between these two aspects of Ravel's life, and it does so with great sensitivity and insight. Another important theme of the novel is the idea of mortality. We see Ravel struggling with his own mortality, both in terms of his declining health and in terms of his legacy. Ekinaz does an excellent job of capturing the sense of urgency and desperation that Ravel must have felt as he faced the end of his life. In conclusion, Ravel, by Jean Ekinaz is a beautifully written and deeply moving novel that offers a fascinating portrait of one of the greatest composers of the 20th century. It is a powerful meditation on the nature of creativity, obsession, and mortality, and it is a testament to the enduring power of music to inspire and uplift the human spirit.